You have tanks. Why have you just got two tanks? Because of their homes? Where are my reptiles? Oh, don't, I thought you meant like actual tanks, like real life army tanks. I know you did, which is why <laughs> I didn't straight up just say for the geckos. Wow. Wow, you're it's a terrible, funny. terrible person. What? You're a terrible, terrible person. Yeah, but what does that have to do with anything? Everything. Mm. Mm. Proof? So how's the life? Uh, here, you know. How How's your family? Katie is in Mexico. Why is she in Mexico? Apparently she wants to get killed. Yeah, I was gonna say, it sounds like she has a death wish. No, um, it, that's where she went for her senior trip with friends. Oh, okay. I did a road trip through California. Fair enough. Katie is spending... The rest of her life in Mexico. <laughs> uh, she went to Cabo. Oh. Okay. She's dead. She may, she may as well kill herself now. I mean, there's no coming back from Mexico. I mean, is she dead or is she kidnapped? It's Both. Real. Well, she'll be kidnapped and then killed. There we go. Get your order straight. I don't know why they would kidnap a dead body. Well, they would kidnap her and then, like, turn her into, like, a drug farm. Like, that's how it works now. She will just become the drug farm. They'll start, like, growing drugs out of her body. Her intestine. And that is how your sister will die. As a drug farm. Or at least she'll die high. I'll die high. Holy shit. Holy shit basket. Yeah. On a scale of 1 to 10, would you yeah. recommend it to a friend? Yeah, I would actually. This game's really good. I mean, dying in Mexico. Oh. Well, no. How long has it been since I went to Mexico? Too long. Uh, I'm not a big South America fan. You're not a big South America fan. Yeah. That's because everything in South America involves rape, pillage, and murder. No. Yeah. You forgot drugs. No, no. That, that's just in the <laughs> raping. They, they don't do drugs down there. I don't know what you're on about. Uh, uh, I mean, so we've, we've covered Katie. How was your mum? Loud. Yeah, and, and nothing different than anything else? No. Yesterday was Father's Day. It was? Mm -hmm. um, this is news to me. As you may or not be aware, my dad doesn't do Father's Day. He hates it. Uh, I bought my dad... Uh, I'm trying to see. Uh, Ice cream and cherry juice. Don't you hate it when you do something but it doesn't work and everything then goes wrong and you die? Did you get raped? I did. How did you know? Alright, on this doll I want you to tell me where it touched you. Um, everywhere. What are you gonna do about? What are you gonna do about solving this, sir? Nothing. This is your your issue here. Yeah, but you're supposed to be helping me through it. That's your job. I have a Snickers. You're not you when you're hungry. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna help. So this I is. I don't remember what I was doing in this game. Oh, I haven't started yet. Are you ready to start? I am at the save point that I loaded in at. 
So have I. Okay, I've started now. When in doubt, shotgun overcomes all difficulties. Why can this girl only load one bullet at a time? Get to the reactor. What reactor? There's a reactor? Apparently. Oh shit. Why is there a reactor? Apollo will not downgrade the hazard containment area due to an unknown presence within the central reactor. Look at how many androids are there. One and a half. I have killed more than one and a half. Mm. I'm an android number four. Oh no, he's grabbed my soul. Apparently, Alicia, I'm becoming hysterical. Help me. Um, pull your dick out. Safe. That's not gonna work. It's it got caught. Red glowing eyes. Use a noisemaker. Have you? Has that ever happened to you? Or some Has that ever happened to you, Alicia, where your dick got caught in the zipper? Yeah, it's terrifying. Did it hurt? No. Oh wow, you are fucking made of steel. Dick's made of steel. You have a steel dick? Yeah. <laughs> Cause that's fucking normal. Okay, I killed like four androids. I'm proud of myself, Dad. You're still a disappointment to me, son. Ah, oh, I know I could count on you to be a disappointment to yourself. Yeah, I constructed an item. Are you proud of me? It's very loud down here. I think that has to do with like everything exploding repeatedly, probably. All the androids are dead, so I don't have to think about those anymore. What am I trying to do though, Alicia? Get wrecked. I think I'm trying to get to like the lower levels, maybe. I don't know. I'm just I'm just running about. Are you trying to get to the reactor? I'm already at the reactor. I'm going to reactor maintenance. It's one level above the reactor. But it's also below the reactor. <coughs> so so Alicia, how's your dad doing? Mm -hmm. Did did he enjoy Father's Day? Did you get him everything he desired? Uh, he threw his back out. He threw you out. No, he threw his back out. He threw. The, can he still walk? God. Uh, yeah. You look not great. Well, I don't think he'll be able to walk if he can't, you know, have a back. Well, I mean, he's just going to go to Walmart later and get a new one. Oh, okay. Can you do that over there? Oh, definitely. You can get anything at Walmart. Okay. So, I went with Mew and Heather to Walmart the other day because yeah. we were bored and trying to burn time before third work. Yeah. And they had ammunition... That wasn't under like any kind of lock. Like I picked it up with my hand, wow. right? And then we were walking through, uh, like the sport outdoor section. Yeah. And there were golf balls that had uh, alarm tags on them. Wow. You can open the container. Just wow. So no one can take the golf ball, but hey, have a fucking shotgun pellet. Did you actually yeah. steal the shotgun pellet? No, but I held it in my hand. Oh, okay. 
Wow, because that makes sense. We were laughing about it. Alicia, I am not in a good place right now. Have How you tried turning it off and on? No, um, I, I happen to have stumbled upon what would be known as the alien's nest. As in multiple aliens? As in many, many little aliens. The fa oh no, there's fucking face hookers here. Yeah, but we knew that was going to be a thing. I'm really glad I brought my shotgun. <laughs> and my flamethrower. And my pistol. Yeah, but how many uh, shots do you actually have? I uh, well, I have like over a thousand flamethrower ammo. How much do you really have? Fucking hell! This place is not good news. Stop beeping! What if that lumber alien happens to not actually be dead? I mean, why would she actually be dead? Okay. She just got launched into space. Oh god, what is going on? I don't know, there's something out there, but I don't know what it is. Start running. There's like screaming and all sorts of shit going on. There are like things all around me. My sensor won't stop going. There are really a fuck ton of uh, androids here. You don't want to know how many aliens are out here. Cool, and the rubber suits means that EMPs don't work. Yep. I learned that out. I I learned that the hard way. Of course, hey Alicia, good news, the alien's here. Yeah, why wouldn't he be? She. Is he. it is it a she or he, he or what is it at this point? What we what we've, what have we decided? Is she a bitch? She's a whore. Or is it a dick? This is crazy. The amount of shit down here is insane. There's like slime dripping off everything and I can't tell if it's like good slime or bad slime. Touch it. I'm not gonna fucking touch it. And my scanner's all but useless. Cause there's so many fucking little aliens running about. I can't tell if it's big alien or normal alien that is coming to eat my soul. These are first world problems, Alicia. You need to understand that. I think Mama's on the way. I just killed her babies. Oh, yep, she's out there. She's not happy that I just murdered her innocent children. Well, I mean, why'd you do that? Well, because they were going to fucking kill me. <laughs> so they're kids. And you're a gorilla. It's a good thing it doesn't know I'm hiding in this conveniently placed hiding spot. Why is there liquid on the ground?
We chose a bad day to go out and party. There's so much slime drifting down, I can't tell if it's the alien or if it's or if it's just slime. Hey, do you know that the shacks on the wall have random shit in it? Oh, those are people, never yeah. mind. It's not just random shit, there's a save point right there next to the alien. Okay, it's gone, I can use the save point. How do you like the alien's nest? Um, I want to know where it produced all this shit to make this nest. Well, that'll be mum alien. Yeah, but the amount of times and body weight this would be. No, if you watch the Alien movie, you'll see how big the Mammalian actually is. Oh god, that egg opened. At least they die really quickly. But they're also kind of terrifying how they go through the water. Okay, fuck off, alien. What if I act? Like regurgitate this nest, or I'm really curious. No, they sh they they egg lay eggs like mammals. I think, from what I understand from the movies. Yeah, but I'm talking about like all the fiber stuff on the wall. Oh. I don't know, it's probably just like alien byproducts. Just shit everywhere? Yeah. Why not? At what point do you just agree that everyone's dead and blow up the ship? Uh this I would have I would have blown up ages ago if I had my way. I mean, really, oh, is it really even worth saving anymore? Because I don't think it is. I, I say we just let the ship burn down. I feel so stupid. Why? I couldn't find the stupid charge thing. And um, wasn't it on, like, the back of the thing? Yeah, I kept running around it, and I would just, every time I looked up, it would just be the front side. Wow. Shit, where the hell? How am I? Yep. Do you want a helpful hint? Sure. Flamethrower is too good in this area. Oh yeah, like it just... The face huggers, they just like immediately... shrivel up. Well that and there's an alien as well. You know, I have a feeling that there might be multiple aliens down here. It really likes to walk about, like, ridiculously. It, like, never stops. It just keeps coming out of its fucking hole. It clearly knows we're here, and it wants to eat us. I, I say at this point, do we, do we really care? Should we just let this fucking thing eat us? I would. Do you know how much that yeah, is going to... <laughs> this is real, I would have given up so long ago. I mean, at what point do you just go, oh, we've been like trying to fucking fight this alien now for like 15 missions or whatever. God, I would die in a horror Return to the central reactor. Ok, 
Okay. Not going too badly so far. Oh no! <laughs> what? Not going badly so far. Oh no! <laughs> I got impregnated. Shit! I've just I've just been impregnated, Alicia. Is it weird that the babies do the impregnating? Uh, a little bit. I mean, well, I don't think they're the ba the. It's weird because like those little face huggers, they come out the eggs and then they lay eggs in your body to hatch like the actual alien, and the face huggers just die once they've done that. It, it's a very okay. strange life cycle. <laughs> It's like, hey, I just gave birth to this thing that's going to plant babies in you to give birth to more of my kind. <laughs> I mean, wouldn't it be easier to just give birth to more aliens? Little bastard so face. what if the face huggers are the equivalent of a male in that species? Oh, barely survived that encounter. Well, oh, that's not very fucking nice. What? You're meant to be more supportive. Die, bitch, die. Support. Uh, Murphy and Overwatch. I really can't think of another support character. A support character for what? Video game? Uh, Lara Croft. You can call her support? Yes. <laughs> it's all about the tombs. The tombs are actually the main characters. Really? Because they seem to be doing a pretty weak job of holding the game <laughs> over. Well, every tomb has its bad day. Not everyone can have a good day, Alicia. The sooner you accept that, the sooner your mum can move on from this world. Did I tell you I was scared of Laura Croft when I was a kid? No, I need to hear this story. <laughs> uh, I played one of the games and I was like, way the fuck too young. Wow. Okay. It's Laura Croft, Alicia. It's not exactly a scary game. No, um... Were you scared of her boob size? <laughs> Triangular boob. <laughs> yeah. No, um... It was one, I think it was the second one? Uh, one of the ones where, you know how the fucking Jeeves guy, he'll like follow you around with a tray? Oh, yes. That was my, that was the only one I've played. Yeah, but yeah, you like explored the mansion and it was that like massive testing ground, like where you could test your, your skills and that, that I never got past. Yeah. I did that forever, but yeah, the I did fucking too. butler creeped the fucking shit out of me. But if you looked at him, he wouldn't move. Yeah, and the only way to get him to stop chasing you was to lock him in the fucking room. But, um... Then one of the levels that you go to is, like, in a jungle. Okay. And it's very jump scary on the, like, animals just pop out of nowhere and attack you. Wow, okay. Yeah, and that's the part that uh, scared me, and for some reason I associated that with uh, anuses. Laura Croft standing <laughs> at the end of the hall trying to kill me <laughs> when I go to the bathroom in the middle of the night. Fucking Laura Croft, man. Stay back, alien. I'll use all my flame for ammo to get rid of you. You just had to do with it. I've pressed the button! Through. You're not allowed in the elevator when I press the button. That's the rules of video games. You done did fuck up. Dude, this alien refuses to... He, he's actually become immune to fire. Like, I'm putting... I'm setting him on fire and he's just walking through it. And it's like, are you kidding me? Are you, you fucking baby. Oh, that time he didn't come really out the fucking... I don't know where I'm going anymore. I'm going forward. Okay. I hope. 
Crouching whilst moving is quieter, but will slow you down. Really? No. Damn. I can power up all the cores, overload them, and then initiate a reactor purge. You'll destroy everything down there. Look, I'm not trying to persuade you out of this room. I'd just like it if you didn't die. Why is it raining in the this core? This is what's going to happen. There are emergency overflow circuits that feed excess power into the this local... This seems kind of counterproductive. Time. It's fucking raining in the court. I'm not even joking. It's actually just raining down here. The nest is right in Mark's way. I have no clue what you just said. It seems really, really, really counterproductive. It's really weird. Overload Alpha Core. Ooh, I'll have all this out there. No ammunition for you. What's going to try and murder me? Oh, there's a Hobot here. If I hit him in the face, will it work? Nope! Oh dear god, they're everywhere. Don't you hate that these robots are just immune to, to shit? It's like giving me all this bolt gun ammo, but these robots are immune to the bolt gun. It's like, oh, what's the point of giving me the fucking ammo then? I haven't used the bolt gun yet. It, it one shots robots that are not in rubber suits. But it has a really long charge up time. Can I burn their rubber suits off with my flamethrower? No. Well, it was worth a try. I mean, I just assumed not. I guess someone's like, shit, get out of there now. No fucking shit. Dude, his face is like leaking molten lava. I've set him on fire, and when I shoot him, his face leaks molten lava. Why is it the second that you step into that place and it looks like that, you didn't just immediately turn around, leave, and blow the ship up? Well, because that would be the sensible thing to do, Alicia. What do you do when you're trapped between two robots? <laughs> In a hard place? No, 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 just a soft place. I'm dead. Magically come back to life? I like how it gives you this fucking gun that instantly kills robots and then it decides, oh yeah, by the way, you can't actually fucking use it. <laughs> and it's like, oh, come on, how is this fucking fair? There are more robots down here than the black man's anus. Yeah, but video games fucking love doing that. Oh, here's a really powerful thing towards the very the end of the game. Enjoy never using it. Not all video games do that. Bioshock Infinite did that. What did Bioshock Infinite give you? Like half of your vigors? Oh, I didn't know. It's, it's, been, it's been a very long time since I played that. I don't remember a lot about it. You seriously got like... Three, I think, in the very end. Oh. Three, I think it was three. That's a good game, though. Hey, I know a game that does follower, like you know, not follower, um, escort missions correctly. Witcher. Yes. Because do you want to know what? Do you know yeah. how it works in that game? They follow you. They die? No, no, they follow you and they go whatever speed you go. Alright. And that really helps to have it work. I'll play it eventually. It's a really good game. You should play it. Yeah, and people tell me Skyrim's really good too. I don't I didn't think Skyrim was that good to be honest. Oh, it's my favorite. I too many times for Skyrim. Okay, so what's different than normal? Um, I played it once at a friend's house for like five hours, and because it was on their Xbox, I couldn't play it, like keep it. 
Then I got it for PC, and it was on my old laptop that broke every five minutes. Oh. You should probably fix so that. I got even further in the game, and then I lost everything. Wow. And then now I have this laptop. Oh, really? How is that fair? Like, this robot, like, grabbed me, I got him off me, and then I instantly got grabbed by another robot. How do I get around these fucking robots? There are so many of them. Like, there's an insane amount of robots here that, like, there's nowhere to hide and nowhere to sneak past them. Because they're all just gangbanging the area. Leroy Jenkins? No. Okay, so I've got to overload two cores. There are emergency overflow circuits that feed excess power into the local capacitor banks on each tower. If I decouple them and discharge the system, the purge will be external. The nest is right in harm's way. I have no clue what you just said. Just find something to hold on to. Don't you love when you have to go a certain direction and the door isn't blocked off? Wait, that actually happened? Yeah. When? Right now. I mean, it's pretty fucking linear, but... Oh, cool, the alien's right fucking behind me. Seriously, how do I get anywhere when half of my guns do no damage to these fucking things? And one hit is enough to kill me. Monkeys? Aimless monkeys, Alicia. Aimless monkeys. Oh my god, it works. It just takes two hits instead of one. Hello, fucking Luya. Okay, okay, let's do this shit. Oh, I flipped that switch, and the other switch gets flipped. Well, that's convenient. Everything's exploding with electric. And I've Holy got a robot. Shit, this thing literally takes 50 years. That gun takes 50 fucking years. Yeah, it actually does take 50 years. I feel myself aging. Yeah, but it's really good. It's effective for killing things. Shoot you in the dick. But if you want to kill an evil robot, this bolt gun is the way to go. Yeah, no, they're one shot. Not for me. Mine only mine after two shot them. Shoot them in the head. Yeah, but what if I miss? Get good. What if I can't? They're walking at you at a slow pace. <laughs> what if I, I like have an emergency breakdown? Um don't. Oh no, there's another one! Fucking hell, these robots just come out of the fucking woodwork. One minute there's like no robots, the next minute there's 15. Okay, I think it's finally over. If there are any more robots, there's definitely a robot production facility like in this fucking reactor core. Maybe they are the reactor. Maybe this is why everything's exploding. <sighs> right, let's overload that, grab that, reload that. What have we got to do Shotgun now? Shotgun shell. Okay, I've got to overload this one. Right, now I've got to overload this one. No doubt we're going to survive. 
Even though this entire building is exploding. This entire space station seems to be exploding. We'll be fine. Because it's a video game. I need to win the episode, but there's too much excitement. <laughs> no, I missed! No, one computer, two computer, or computer three. Running causes accidents, it probably does, but I'm gonna have to start running because there's an army of fucking robots <laughs> and I don't have enough ammo to kill all of them. Oh, wow. At least it tells you which core you have to blow up on your map. Or like a pack or whatever. Yeah, that's really useful. Clearly you've never had an armada of robots trying to murder yourself. No. I have. There are like nine robots right now following me. <laughs> Luckily, the room is designed in such a way where you can easily avoid them. Why is everything- Can you imagine if this is how hacking was in real life? Well, we'd all be fucked. Get the numbers to match. Oh, I can end the episode. Are you sure you're good to end the episode? Uh, end it whenever you want. Everyone, thanks for watching this episode. I hope you've enjoyed. We'll see you next time.